Los Angeles is home to many different festivals celebrating a number of different things. Valley View News reporter Nick Popham tells us about a beer festival with a bit of a twist. The month of October is the time for two specific things. Dressing up in costumes and having beer. Those two pastimes are a staple at almost any beer festival around the world. But what makes this Oktoberfest any different? All right, the beer is perfect. Declare Vegan Oktoberfest officially open. Please raise your glasses and join me on the count of That's three. right, it's One, vegan. Two. Vegan Oktoberfest is celebrating its second year in Los Angeles, providing people with around 60 vendors distributing beer and all things vegan. From vegan cheese, to pretzels, to even, yes you're seeing that right, faux bacon covered donuts. A festival like this has gotten many people in the LA area excited for its return. I had so much fun last year, met so many cool people and the energy, I just had to come back. I was like, it's an excuse to come back and have a good time. It's really interesting to be able to come to an alternative Oktoberfest and see that there are alternatives to what you would normally be drinking or eating. Everyone is so happy. There's so much positive energy all around you. I mean, you go to any of these booths, everyone's very open and just excited to see you and welcoming. Vegan Oktoberfest has been a success thus far. Many people giving positive reviews of the day, though some people have come up and said that they aren't quite sure if everything here is actually vegan. Right away we saw Shipyard Brewery was here and uh, we've come across, because we are very strict vegans and their processes are not vegan. It's, it's vegan Oktoberfest, so it's, if, if there's a, a star with some fine print that says not everything here will be vegan, then maybe I missed it. But if you tell me it's vegan Oktoberfest, one would assume it's a vegan Oktoberfest. Despite some complaints, one of the event's coordinators, Jill Ryther, says you don't have to be vegan to enjoy this festival. We offer more beers, unlimited pours from more beers than any other Oktoberfest, hands down, in California. So, vegan or not, you want to drink a lot of good beer, you want to fill your cup up as many times as you can, this is the place to be. Ryther went on to say this event does more than just pour and serve. It goes towards Expand Animal Rights Now. It's a nonprofit. It's actually a nonprofit that I founded, and we use the legal system to help animals. So it really kind of goes hand in hand, so it's perfect. So whether it's dancing the polka or trying your best to yodel, it doesn't take any real meat or dairy to have a good time. In downtown Los Angeles, Nick Popham, Valley View News.